right, you guys, I've got some very exciting news. Uh, <laughs> no, we're gonna throw a banger. Everyone pull up. Katie, 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 Katie. Aww. And <gasps> you said what? Good morning, everybody. Here's Katie Donnelly. Hey, Shadis. Hi, Katie. Hi, Are you checking your email? No, so I'm sending this TikTok that I sent to Katie to you. Oh, okay. So I um, was reading this morning on the U.S. Coast Guard Academy site, and they were saying that originally the AIM applications or the AIM decisions were supposed to be made on April 30th, but they switched to March or to May 5th, which is today. So Katie should find out today whether or not she was accepted to AIM. AIM is the, oh, I keep reading what it stands for, but I keep forgetting something, it, something mission, something, something mission. Anyway, AIM is the summer program that, um, you can apply for if you want to go to the U.S. Coast Guard Academy. You apply for it the junior your junior summer, so the summer after your junior year, which will be the year before your senior. Well, you apply year, for it. You apply for it you to apply go for it halfway through your sophomore or your junior year, and then you go there in the summer of your junior year. Yes, yeah. and it's very competitive to get in, um, but it's it sort of it's immersion something. A, something immersion mission something. Anyway, so it it's an immersion program. So you go there for a week and get a chance to see what it's like to be a student at the Coast Guard Academy. Um, this year they're doing three sessions. One session is in person and two are virtual. So um, she would have the choice of either going there or doing it virtually and then visiting later or something. So anyway, um, we should find out today whether she gets into that program or not. It doesn't mean if you don't get into the program, it does not mean that you um, can't apply or ha don't have a but chance to apply, but it definitely helps. So stay tuned, find out. Did you look at your email yet to see? Yeah, there's nothing in yet. Okay, we'll, we'll keep looking. Now she's making her shake. Um. Hello, everybody. Shh. Hi, Kate. <laughs> I don't want to interrupt you. Katie's working on her SAT prep. So she took SATs the first round, and now she's going to take it again on June 5th. So I'm gonna be kind of quiet when I talk, but she is working on SAT prep on Khan Academy, hoping to improve her math score. She had a really, really good score the last time on English, and now she's working on her math score. I, I am preparing because tomorrow Mike and I are going away. We are going to Florida for um, a few nights with my brothers and sisters and my brothers in laws and sister in law, my parents. It's our adult trip away. If you guys remember, two years ago we took a trip to Walt well, Disney World, just the adults, and we had so much fun. Tried to go last year, but it was closed, and now this year we're going to the beach. So um, I am going to be preparing some food for the kids to eat. They can certainly make their own food, but we have a lot of food, and I um, want to make sure that I make it so they can have some meals themselves and then some meals that I've made. Anyway, I'm gonna make Green Chef, which I'm so excited about. We, um, thank you so much to Green Chef for sponsoring this video, by the way, and sending us these meals. I'm gonna make for them some peanut udon chicken and beef enchiladas. So I'm gonna make it and I have these like containers I'm gonna put in the fridge and they can just pull them out, heat them up and eat them while we're gone. It's all on, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I have no idea what you just said. What did you say? I said hi, ladies and gentlemen. You said what? You said hello, ladies and gentlemen. Hi. Do you speak Ryan? Because I don't speak Ryan that sometimes. Very, that was very clear. Hello, I mean, ladies and gentlemen. That's what I heard. So what's going on, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> so we got a lot going on right now. Ryan obviously is eating some beignets from the other day. Oh. Katie is over there and she is practicing for her SATs. She's taking some um, SAT preparatory stuff, math mostly. And Brennan is downstairs completing his capstone project. So as a senior in <gasps> English, that look can good? Can you make that really quick so I can eat it for practice? Yes, I'll make it right now. Will you, what, oh, what? there's two servings. Maybe you can make it for me and Kaden. Okay. Right, okay. Fine. That looks so good. <laughs> All right, you guys, so this is the deal. I'm gonna miss you, and I'm gonna miss you. Child. No, you're Aww. not, you're in Florida. I know, so I'm going to Florida. Dad and I are going to Florida. I know, I'm making those too. Wait, <gasps> what? Oh, roasted cream. I think you're gonna make that for me. Mm -hmm. Oh, whoa. Child. 
So you guys, Mike and I are gonna go to Florida with my brothers and sisters and my parents and my sister-in-law and my brother-in-law. And we always go, we have an annual adults, family adults trip and we're gonna go and we're gonna leave the kids home by themselves. So if you could keep an eye on them and let us know how everything's going, that would be Florida. awesome. <laughs> no, we're gonna put a banger, everyone pull up. We yeah. definitely have some rules and um, so we'll let you know. We'll probably vlog. We guys vlog while we're gone? Oh, wow. let, yeah. let us know what's going on here. I'll make so. You what? I think I think life just stops when you guys go. I know, right? What the heck? I mean, like, parties are a great place to walk. No. Like, there, you know there, what's going on. There won't be any parties. And I'm leaving a very detailed list of who's supposed to take who where. However, oh. there's always some kind of shenanigan while we're gone. But, I mean, I understand that. But no parties. There's Katie. Are you ready? <laughs> Aww. That's so cute. Why do you always want to stop hugging me? I was looking at you. <gasps> oh my gosh. It's so cute. It's so cute. All right, you guys. So, Caden is taking Katie to practice today. A little bit of track practice. Are you going to pole vault today at track? My hair looks good today. and Nobody said anything. It looks I fantastic. Look awesome. hey, wait a minute. Caden already told you it looked good. Because I said, Caden, tell me my hair looks good today. <laughs> she did. <laughs> she looks for compliments, doesn't she? And you're a good boyfriend, so you told her. That was very kind of you. All right, you guys. You go to practice. Yeah. And, hey, wait. Let me just gather everybody together. Caden, come here, please. Why? Katie, come here, please. Because I have to tell you something. Well, I'm... Really? Okay, I'm gonna tell you fast. Caden, I know you already know this, but Mike and I are going away four nights. Party. We can have a party. <laughs> there will be Lots no party. party. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so you're, you're welcome to come over. It's all good. But make sure Katie stays in line, please. Oh, of course. Yeah. You told me to make sure everyone else stays in line. Well, yeah. Caden, make sure you stay in line and you make sure your brothers so stay in line. So you're saying he's in charge of everyone? Well, not your brothers, but you're in charge of your brothers. Really. But cool. in, in the way of a, you know, Consumer, primary, secondary, if you control that. Consumer, primary, <laughs> secondary. Wow, someone's been studying uh, <laughs> history. Yeah, there you go. All right, you guys, so go to practice. You're going to be late. You're going to be late. You're going to be late. I love you. We're talking about beignets. Beignets? Beignets. So had, <laughs> oh, no. We had a beignet, and then we made a circle. She goes, it's a beignet. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. <laughs> I love it. That's very funny. All right. She's like, excellent. Yeah, yeah. I love it. All right, guys. See you later. Have a good practice. guys i've got some very exciting news this is so exciting okay so i just got back from the grocery store you can see i have all my groceries in here and i went to the flower store too and got some flowers and i'm going to try to plant some of them maybe before we go tomorrow but um i while i was in the grocery store um checking out katie sent me a text and it was a photograph of her computer screen, which was a letter from the U.S. Coast Guard Academy saying that she got into the AIM program. She was accepted, so she gets to go this summer and um, see what it's like to be in the Coast Guard Academy. So 
so this is so very exciting. She's been wanting this and I really hope it works out for her. And um, she's been talking to the pole vault coach there and it's all good. So I'm so proud of her. She's work, been working very hard. And as you know, she's studying for her SATs to take the second um, SAT on June 5th to try to improve her scores and um, improve her chances of getting in. So I, I don't know if she told you that yet. I don't know if she vlogged that or anything or let you guys in on that, but, and I'm sorry that she's not breaking the news to you, but I just can't, I'm so excited. I just can't hold it in. <laughs> so um, anyway, let me take the groceries in. And then um, when we pick up Katie, she's at drive time. So I already tell you that, oh, I, I'm all jumbled. So she's at drive times right now. Mike dropped her off. So the second drive time that she has of three that she needs to have to get her driver's license so um she's there so i can't talk to her right now and i'm so sorry if i already said that <laughs> Yay! all right katie Kate, Kate. see you soon all right so brenda came out to help me unload the car thanks v man and look who's in there hey kitty kitty the flowers smell good i think you're right is that why you're in there because the flowers smell good um oh baby Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's so cute. She's Little awesome. Alice. Come on up, bud. Yes. yes. Alright, you guys, so we are all that together. Katie, 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 Katie. Do you want to tell your brothers what the big news is? Well, as you know, I've been working hard. You have. I've been grinding. Yeah. Oh my gosh. One of my dreams is to go to a service academy. She's really going to milk this. She is going to milk You probably already know what it is. It's it, uh, but obviously. <laughs> Congratulations. If you guys don't know what AIM is, it's kind of like a precursor to the Coast Guard Academy. Uh, all the service academies have it. It's and, like the uh, training camps. Exactly. Yeah, it's like a training slash recruiting camp in the summertime. Yes. yes, we've talked about that a little bit already. That is so mm -hmm. fantastic. Congratulations, Kate. I am so proud of you. Starting soon. Yeah. I'm gonna have to cut off, um, cut down on the Oreos. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the double stuffed Oreos aren't helping. That's not gonna help. No, but we have like fitness tests. Oh, I thought you were gonna say, but we have like 24 of them. <laughs> <laughs> So if we have 24 Oreos and they're double stuffed, we have 48 stuffs. 48 stuffs, exactly. All right, you guys, so I've also gathered you here today because Dad and I are going to be going away. Daddy-o? Yes, we are. There are no <laughs> parties in the house. I'm going to get one more Oreo just because I love them, but let me just say this. Let me say the are having a party. It's already planned. There's, gonna be, there's 200 people that RSVP. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Is it Friday or Saturday, Katie? <laughs> well, it wasn't. No, seriously, no one in the house. No yeah. one in the house. No, so we can't be in the house? I, oh, oh. Right. Exactly. Yeah. So, I said during the day they're allowed to have their friends over, but there's no sleepovers. Nobody sleeps here, and you don't sleep in anybody else's house. That's okay? really dumb. Well, no, I like, I no it's not dumb. I don't know who's going to be here. Like, yeah, they text us and ask us. Yeah. Well, so here's what I can see. Bob, you still can have friends over. Well, not 17 friends over. That's right. Why but that's why, Ryan, that's why Brandon always texts me and says, hey, do you mind if I have there are really Ethan people and, in the first place. and Will I have and two friends. Liam? Uh -oh. Aiden and Molly. Right. So those are the only people that I would ever want to hang and out I, with. And I trust you guys. I trust you guys. But but you also let me know what's going yeah. on. Like Ryan would also, say, hey. Also, me and my friends never really hang out at anyone's house. It's either the beach or we're on our bikes. Right. So. I'd like to know when people are going to be in the house. Yeah. Brennan, Brennan does that. You guys, will, you guys will. House. You are the man of the house. I'm the only one that has enough I'm friends to have like a party. I'm and a half years old. Mm-hmm. And you can be arrested. <laughs> Exactly. Yeah. So I will be and try as an adult. I'll be arresting your idea. Okay. Oh, very nice. And it's going to jail, so we're having a party. Oh. Uh, no. To answer Friday to Saturday night question, it's like Friday, but it like rolls over to Saturday. So it's a seventy-two hour better. Well. Basically. Fantastic. Yeah. It's Excellent. Like all, night. Yeah. all right. So I left you. I went grocery shopping today and got you guys tons of food. I gave oh, Brennan nice. a tour. I gave Brennan a tour <laughs> of all the food, so he knows what's there. You guys have Katie. What are you doing? I'm listening. Oh, yeah, I need your attention. I, right up here. Thank you. So there's tons of food in there. So some of it needs to be made, but some of it is already made. So don't be lazy, right? right. Just open the freezer or open the refrigerator, and, and I'm happy to give you guys a tour too. Right. I'm going to leave a list of everybody who needs to be where, 
where they need to be and when they need to be there. So I'd like you guys to hold each other accountable or just even remind each other like, oh, hey, remember, you have to take Katie to practice at 1.30 or, hey, remember, Ryan, you need to get on, um, you know, school or whatever. You know what I mean? So Ryan, if you guys... I will be shaking you until you arrive in the morning. Thank you, Katie. You're going to be the waker upper of okay. Ryan. Good job. Oh, I was gonna say it was Ryan sleeps through his alarm all the time, so it's hard. hard. And so does Brendan. In the morning. I mean, it is what it is, right? You get up at this time, you go at this time, you do this. It's like, no, there's Mom, no I'm disagree. So there's no Mom. like debate. Yes. Mom, I woke up this morning at. <laughs> bless, bless you. you. I need to get out of here. I'm allergic to Katie. Oh my gosh. Oh. Right. I woke up this morning and <laughs> um. <laughs> Dad has the hiccups. I was, <laughs> I was supposed to get up at nine, but I was like, you know what? There's nothing wrong with more time, you know, like extra time cushion. So I ended up waking up at like 8.15. Yeah, that's good. Very good. So I, 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 I did hear you get bring it back to sleep or... <laughs> mm -hmm. Or just get up and start my day. Like there's nothing, good. there's nothing wrong with this, but Katie, whenever she does something like a little bit productive, will tell everybody about it. Well, she, she, like, she, I, she's I'm like that. She likes positive reinforcement. She's like, hey, she's everybody, serious. just so you know, I'm perfect. All right, so listen, I'm going to wrap this up. I'm going to wrap this up. So we're just talking about what's going to go on while we're away. And so you have food. Yes. You have a list of, time, of things to do. Mm -hmm. And you have the rules. So have a great weekend. And I I fall asleep on the couch. what made you happy today, Rye Guy? Playing spike ball with the boys and uh, having a great dinner with you. Fantastic. Yes. Thank you. What made you happy today, Kate? Um, being productive. <laughs> And getting into AIM. And getting into AIM. Oh my goodness. Holy cow. How oh, Michael John? What made you happy today? Thank you for asking. I'm being proud of Kate for getting into the... Uh, oh, thanks, Dad. Into Thank AIM. You. Brandon, what made you happy today? Finally finishing my capstone. Congratulations. Oh, we didn't even talk about that. Oh my gosh. Brandon finished his capstone project for graduation, his English project, and I watched it. It was excellent. And what made me happy today was all of it. Brandon getting his capstone. We talked a little bit about housing for him for college, mm -hmm. Katie getting her, um, getting into AIM, um, and I went to the flower store. That made me very happy. Go. Yes. And that's I'm like your favorite place in the world. Up. I love the flower yeah. store. I yeah. haven't been there yet this year, so it's nice to go. You got the flower store. I love it. So you guys, comment down below what made you guys happy today. We hope you had a wonderful day, and um, we read it all. We can't wait to see, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.